Dave Edelman seems your average 20-something. He likes to hang out with his friends, restore classic cars, watch sports, but during the day, he's a rocket scientist. The work I'm doing at Aerojet is very interesting. There's a, it's a different challenge every day, and there's a good variety between the workloads, and I work with good people. This cool young professional is a mechanical design engineer at Aerojet, a major contractor specializing in missile and space propulsion. Dave's passion for engineering was propelled forward a few years ago when his high school team competed in the Team America Rocketry Challenge, or TARC, the world's largest rocket competition. Aerojet sponsored Dave's TARC team at the challenge. Nice. AIA created the Team America Rocketry Challenge in 2003 as a way of marking the 100th anniversary of the Wright brothers' first flight. We decided to make it an annual event because it was so popular, students, teachers, and parents. The goal here is to spark interest in the aerospace industry, and so far, 50,000 students have taken part. With more than 60% of the aerospace workforce over the age of 50, and 13% now eligible for retirement, the workforce shortage in America's aerospace industry is being called a crisis. The need to replace those experienced workers is growing quickly and competition for that skilled workforce is growing too. The U.S. Department of Labor projects 2.5 million science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, or STEM, jobs will be vacant by 2014. But the number of U.S. engineering graduates is down to less than 80,000 a year. That's where TARC comes in. With 650 teams competing each year and an average of six members per team, TARC is doing its part to match the next generation of innovators with great aerospace jobs. We recently have just interviewed a few dozen undergraduate engineers for summer internships and several of them noted that they participated in TARC in high school. Team America Rocketry uh, Challenge definitely sparked my interest in engineering and I hope to be an aerospace engineering uh, duty officer in the Navy. The contest inspires kids by making rocketry educational and fun. I think TARC is really interesting because it really applies your math skills, your phys physics skills into an activity. It's not like a group project. It's like something you actually want to do with friends and I just like have a blast doing it. They design and build model rockets, then launch them to reach a specified altitude and return to Earth at an exact time. Oh, and the raw egg payload must return unbroken. This competition helps students realize that math and science are fun when applied to a real world challenge. TARC is about team-based, project-focused, collaborative learning. Math is the basis, but students embrace the fun and the challenge. These are the kind of smart, creative people Lockheed Martin really needs, and that's why we support TARC. The Team America Rocketry Challenge Finals take place every May, just outside Washington, D.C. The 100 teams with the best qualifying scores make it to the final round fly-off. Participating in TARC really has interested me in, in studying aerospace. Before I was interested, but TARC has really, really got me going because uh, it's just a lot of fun to understand what you're doing and to have a great application for it and something that's it's important to, uh, for this modern age. TARC winners receive $60,000 in scholarships and prizes, and the top team travels to compete at an international air show. In terms of introducing kids to what a typical engineering program is, a design, build, trials, run a trial, something's not right, modify it, etc. I think this is, this is the best bang for the buck. And there's a lot of camaraderie, and there's a lot of chemistry, and there's a lot of good competition that goes on. So it's a phenomenal program. Together, we are working to encourage today's young generation to be part of tomorrow's aerospace workforce. With incredible programs like TARC and other efforts underway throughout our industry, including Raytheon's own Math Moves You program, I know together we can make a difference. The aerospace industry definitely offers good careers. There's good variety and definitely good challenges. And I would, I would encourage middle schoolers and high schoolers to get involved in the Team America Rocketry Challenge. Good for students, good for industry, good for America. With the Team America Rocketry Challenge, the sky is not open.